another video. Today I thought I would show you guys how I have been making a super easy cookie recipe. It is four ingredients and you can be eating cookies in less than 20 minutes. So I found this recipe a couple years ago. I wrote it down. I'm going to try to find out where I got it and if I can I can put that link in the description otherwise I'm going to um, definitely put the instructions and the ingredients in the description box for you guys. So let's go ahead and get to it. It is super easy, four ingredients. You are going to need a red velvet cake mix. Um, this is the one that I found. You are going to need two large eggs, one third cup of oil, and one cup of white chocolate chips. Those are all you're gonna need to make these cookies. So, let's go ahead. I'm just gonna dump in the red velvet cake mix. Okay, all you have to do is beat in the eggs. Dump in your one third cup of oil. I'm gonna be using my stand mixer. You can definitely use a handheld one. This batter does get a little thick, but you could definitely still use a handheld one. So we are going to mix this up first. After that, I usually just stir in the chocolate chips so they don't get all beat up. is a pretty thick batter so that is how it's supposed to be if you make it try to get that off okay throw that over here. okay so that is it all you have to do now is dump in your one cup of white chocolate chips and then just mix them up. This is a super easy recipe. This is like a party favorite. If we ever go anywhere, I'll make these. Everybody always loves them. Okay, I just got a regular cookie sheet. I laid some parchment paper down. I'm gonna spray it with some Pam. real good so your cookies don't stick. So again, I just get a spoon, I just kind of scoop a little out, and it's really sticky but it's okay. About like that big, okay? It is really messy dough. Oh god, this is why I use a spoon. Easier to just kind of spoon it out Otherwise, you're gonna get it all over ya. Okay. You don't have to put them super far apart. I've noticed these don't really like flatten out and get really big. So that's usually about how I do it. The three, six, nine, so yeah. Uh, 12 of them on a pan. And I've still got probably more than half the batter left. So, just gonna make sure these are all equal. A couple of them look a little smaller. Gosh. Okay. All right, guys, that looks good. I'm gonna rinse my hands off real quick and then we're gonna throw these in the oven. 10 to 12 minutes, I'll probably do 11. I think about 11 was the last time I cooked them at. And they came out perfect. All right, let's throw these guys in. Let's pop them in there. All right guys, we are back. Um, 
I have the first 12 cookies out cooling for you guys to see, and I have another 12 in the oven. Um, so you can make about two and a half dozen. I have enough batter to probably make three more cookies, but I didn't wanna, three or four more, but I didn't wanna shove them on that pan. So you can probably make about two, two and a half dozen, just depending on how big you make the cookies. So these are the 12 that I already took out. I laid them out so you guys can see them. Again, they look really nice. The dark red with the white chocolate chips in them. If you set them out, they're definitely a party favorite. Everybody's gonna go to them. They taste amazing and they are super easy to make. So I'm going to go, I'm going to grab a cookie, grab a glass of milk, and I will see you guys next video. Nothing's playing right now.